What if Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone were directed by Michael Bay? In a world where magic and machinery coexist, Harry Potter discovers that he is the chosen one destined to protect the Philosopher's Stone, also known as the Allspark. Those who possess the stone would have unlimited power. As Harry arrives at Hogwarts, he finds out that the Allspark attracts the attention of the Dark Lord Voldemort and his evil army of Death Eaters, Robot Spiders, and Decepticons. Now Harry, Ron, and Hermione need to find a way to obtain the stone first, protect those they love, and prevent the approaching Armageddon orchestrated by Voldemort and his robot army. Magic and spells can't stop Decepticons, Harry. But what shall we use then? Weapons. Armed with advanced and dangerous weaponry, Harry and his friends come together for a heroic and perilous battle that will alter the fate of wizards, muggles, and robots. With Michael Bay's distinctive style, the intense action sequences come to life, providing an immersive experience for the audience. Master has given Dobby a weapon. Every explosion is meticulously choreographed, and each magical duel is carefully crafted, resulting in an adrenaline-pumping spectacle that keeps viewers on the edge of their seats. And of course, in Michael Bay's take on Harry Potter, expect an abundance of cool cars, stunning sunset shots, and captivating slow-motion sequences.